What is up, guys? Welcome back to another round of Railroader. We're picking up with our uh, Dillsboro Northbound Local. This is right after our last video in succession. Nothing's been skipped. Uh, we got to go north. We got to work the northbound local out of Dillsboro. We got to work the southbound local out of uh, Dillsboro. We got a few cars we need to sort out here in the yard. We're kind of hanging out waiting on our passenger train, right? Our passenger train, number one train is just now Bob Barker's. And uh, the 510 has gotten up here to Whittier. So we got a whole bunch of cars set off up there too. So I think probably what we're going to do is just go ahead and go up there to Whittier while we're waiting on the passenger train. And we'll make our... Uh, We'll make our set outs. Uh, let's see. Yeah, we've got a crap ton of uh, sawmill cars. Let's see. What do we got? How are they ordered here? Stenzel. Stenzel. Yeah, I kind of think. Um, trying to think how I want to do this. Let's go ahead and pull this guy forward. Let's select him. We'll take him forward. Like number four is good. But so yeah, he's AI. So manual. Now he's set. Reverse. Yeah, I kind of think um that's a lot of sawmill cars. Holy crap. And we got a stencil on the bottom too. That sucks. I think by the time I had sorted this train, it took me so long to sort all this mess out down at Silva at the interchange because we had like four, almost 40 cars, like 38 cars. By the time I got to that one, I was like, screw it. It's going to Whittier. It's fine. <laughs> it's going to Whittier. I don't even care anymore. Like, oh man, it was a lot, right? This is going to be a lot of work up here. Yeah, it is. This is going to be a ton of work. We'll see what we can do. Uh, let's get this guy up here. I may, uh, I don't know how I'm going to do this. I may post uh, both these on one day. Really, I don't know. Let's take it. Yeah, I'm pretty much going to have to. I think, I think I'm going to have to do two in one day. Maybe a two video day. I, I don't want to skip around on this too much. I don't want to skip around out of order. I don't mind skipping days per se, but I don't want to skip like order. If that makes sense about this guy right here. Uh, let's see. Yeah, let's make her cut right here. Take him to the switch. Yeah, I, I don't want to skip order. In other words, I, I don't want to do something one day and then like the next video is something that I did the day before that, you know, like I said, I don't mind skipping ahead in time because it's still in chronological order. It just skipped ahead, but I, I don't want to go backwards. So, uh, anyway, yeah, we're up here in, uh, we're up in Whittier. I'm trying to get this stuff taken care of because I really want to get that Mikado. Really just do. I know I've said that a bazillion times. I want the Mikado in case you guys didn't know. I really want the Mikado. Really want the Mikado. Let's stop this guy right here. Line you in. I don't know. Like, I was really hoping we could put all the uh, Whittier cars over here. I mean, we could. I just wanted to clear up between the switches, and that's not going to happen whatsoever. That's not going to happen. All right, so we'll set these guys over. We'll just set them out, and then the Whittier yard job, we'll uh, sort these out later, and we'll get it taken care of, but it's a lot of cars. 515 tons. This is, We're going to be shedding a good, a good bit of weight. So he should have an easy trip up to um, Bryson. To be easy peasy. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, it's not my car, so it'll be alright. Keep going. That handbrake off of him. Not my car. That's uh that's the reading. I'm not worried about it. <laughs> it's fine. Oh, he's got air on it too. Let's bleed you off. Now it's good. Yeah, let's just shove all these guys in the clear. Man, that's a ton of cars, right? That is so many cars coming through the sawmill here. 
I, I remember thinking the other day when we pulled all those cars over there, I was like, we don't we we don't have anything inbound like the plants cleaned out, you know. We uh we delivered the logs. But that was it. Uh really we need to leave that Ala car the Ala cars need to stay here too, honestly, like Yeah, I think so. The Ala cars need to stay as well. We'll just take him on the local. I don't know. The train's not very heavy, right? Like, we don't have much going north. We may take him with us. To, I, I know this sounds weird, right? But this kind of happened in real life, too. Take him to Bryson and then put him on the 511 and work him back south. I, I, think, I think that might be what we do. might be what we do I don't know I haven't decided yet all right let's go ahead and cut this guy off right here let's reverse him uh it, it really it's like the thing that we got going against us doing that is the whole time constraint as far as like timely delivery and that sort of thing I just don't know like they may have a better chance being delivered with the five the 511 going south than they would ever have with the uh, Whittier yard job. Yeah, we're just going to take them. We'll take them. I, I know. Like, to most people don't know anything about it. It's like, why are you taking them past Ayla just to bring them back south? But that actually happened in real life. I couldn't tell you how many times I saw cars, like, go through the town on the local that I was working and go, like, 100 miles north and then turn around and come south because sometimes the, the customer would be a little bit hot for the car they'd want the car in a hurry right and you're like well yeah it's going through town right now but it's going to wherever you know it's going to atlanta <laughs> it's going to atlanta it'll be back south tomorrow you know like it, it, for real it really happened that way so not out of the realm of possibility for that to happen we'll just do that we'll take them with us we'll sort them out up there it's uh Bryson. So this guy should be good to go on about his business and he should be good to go all the way to Bryson. And um, not have to worry about cold or water. Let's see. Let's go to locomotive, orders, road, reverse, warp speed. $140, nice, man. You know, I throw off on the passenger ops, but it, it's still, like, it's a it's a nice steady income. It really just is. It's a steady income. All right, all these, I just got to double check these switches because sometimes I'm the world's worst about leaving them, and this guy is running through all the way. Okay. He's good with that. Let's go back to the map. Let's, uh, Alo, we're not worried about. So we're going to take him all the way up to Bryson. Skip up here to Bryson. I messed around with my graphics setting the other day, trying to, um, get this thing to run a little better. I don't, I don't know. It's weird. Like I'm getting decent frames. 50, 51. I think I was getting better frames, honestly, uh, before I changed the settings, though. I gotta think, where do I want this guy to go? I really think this track right here. That'd be a good track. We'll run him in there. And then stop. He'll stop on the other end. We got a few outbound cars up here, so at least we'll have something coming south. Uh, yeah, all these industries up here, tier one, that's why we're not generating a lot of traffic up in Bryson. But I, I don't want to go to... Uh, sweet, he's gotten by. Now we... The passenger train is at Dillsboro. Uh, anyway, Bryson, I don't want to change it to, to a higher tier until we have uh, motive power that can handle the tonnage a little better, right? I just I feel like we're kind of maxed out on our tonnage. All right, I'm I, yeah, I'm going to put a few Z here. I I really or I mean the switch will hold it. So we'll just let that do its thing. I'm just worried that it's just going to keep going south. And I need him to turn right here. I don't need him to... Um, I don't need him to keep going north. 
Get this guy. Um, yeah, back to the number two now. We can do what we need to do with him. Alright, so this guy is going north. This one's going south. This one's staying here. This one's going south. These two are going north, and I've already forgot where. I think these are going south too, right? So, southbound track, northbound track. Southbound track will also be the cars that are staying in Dillsboro proper. So, I think that's what we're going to do. Let's do that. All right, let's take this guy. Select him. Numero dos. Reverse. We do have a handbrake on it somewhere. Where is that handbrake at? Uh, to this one right here. No. There we go. That one. Yeah. Southbound track, northbound track. Remember that, Spur. Muy importante. So we need to kick the two bottom ones over. The knees need to go back in this track. That one needs to go over. That one needs to go over. That one needs to go over. Okay. Yeah, so we're not... We don't have a whole heck of a lot of cars. I just want to get these. Uh, I, I want to get these spotted up and get as much money as I can generated. Eleven thousand two hundred and seventy-six. We're looking for a twelve to uh, thirteen before we get the Mikado. That put us at, with the trade in. That put us at eighteen thousand. I think it's sixty. I want to have a little money left over. Is what we're trying to do. So this video may not be quite as long. There we go. All right, he's stopping. So we got to kick these over. Go forward. Warp speed. Ah, oh, he just, he just coupled back up, right? Yep. No air on it, so we don't have to worry about that. Not quite as vigorous of a kick. We got all that tonnage we're hanging on to. Hopefully they'll go on. Alright, now these two go on the northbound side. I hope I'm right on that. These are in Dillsboro, right? Like, these are right there in front of the depot. They're right in front of the depot. All right, let's get another kick. These are northbound. Ellen in. Love that car. That's one of the great things about seeing all these names and stuff. All right, let's stop that guy. Get these guys kicked over. I think we've got more stuff going south than we do north. Yeah, we do. All this is going south as well, too. We may as well shove them in there. Instead of kicking them, we'll just shove them. I kind of wonder if we should just go in and work the southbound local first. There's more cars to spot up, right? kind of wonder um you know what let's kick that guy in there we're going to do something here because of this car that stays oh wait i didn't throw the switch damn it spurs seriously he went to northbound track come on all right let's pull him back Stop these guys. Whoa, stop. Look at this other guy back north. Yeah, I was trying. I had a plan. I really, I want to keep this guy on the very bottom of the southbound track. So we just go ahead and spot him on the way out south. But All right, so let's kick this guy in there. Forward. There we go. 
Her coupler. Her brake. Nice. All right, that's going to work out. All right, now we go back to the northbound side. Really, this one should have gone on a head in. Like, it's just a little train. It's not... It's, it's not a huge train, so blocking isn't that big of a deal, right? When you only got a handful of cars, like you can dig through them and kind of sort them out as you go. Not really that big of a deal, but... Stop this guy right here. We're just setting him over out of the way for now. We'll come back to him in a second. I go back to this track. Yeah, I think we're going to work the southbound stuff first. Do a little kick. That'll do. Did I not get that switch? I hope I got that switch. Stop this guy. <laughs> it gets a little overwhelming after a while. Like you're trying to get all this stuff. There we go. All right, now we got to go in and grab that other car. A little handbrake. Uh, it's not too bad. That wasn't too bad. I think they give you up to 10 now, right? Like it's not, it's not as much damage or something. We'll grab that guy, put him on the bottom of this one. And then we'll be set. Knock that handbrake off. Uh, release. There we go. Reverse. Nice. And then we'll kick this one back on this side and then we'll be set. Yeah, we should have never hung on to that silver car. I don't know what I was thinking. Like I said, it's the first time we've really done any industries down here, believe it or not. Other than the paper mill. We just added all these other extra industries. That switch. And this guy, he does no, all right, no handbrakes on them. Come on. There we go. Let's shove these in to clear a little bit. Number one's got a, okay, he's a Silva. Did he, did he get our money? I don't know if he's unloaded yet down there. So the thing about working the southbound local is that we, we got to contend with the, um, we could go to Dillsboro though. I think that'll work out perfect actually. Oh, we could have kicked him in there. He would have barely cleared up, but we could have done that. Someone's got a handbrake. Who's got the handbrake? That one. Shove him in the clear a little bit. Nice. All right, back the other way. We could have really kicked the piss out of him and had him down there at the other end of the yard ready to go. There we go. 205. 86 fares for that little depot at Silva. Are you kidding me? Man, that's a lot. All right. Uh, forward's what we need. Give this guy a little kick. Send him down a northbound track. I gotta reverse this guy just here so we can run around him. Those other cars are still barely creeping along. That's pretty cool. Alright. You forward. Nice. Alright, we're good. We're good now. This guy's gonna roll down here and couple up. Do they have a handbrake on him? Go ahead and release him.
Sweet. Put a handbrake on this one. Nice. All right. So we're just about good to go here. We're just about good to go. We got to go. Uh, we got to go tackle. Um, the passenger train. Figure him out in a second. This guy's lying through. Passenger train still sitting there waiting. Yeah, we got to run him around. I think once we, if we could get Bryson to tier, like higher than tier one stuff, I think we would start doing really good as far as money. I just, I learned a really hard lesson when I got the south end of the railroad when I bought that. Like I did, I was nowhere near prepared for that. Oh man, you stop short, you little son of a. All right, there we go. I wasn't prepared for it. We didn't have nearly enough motive power to handle everything that we had going on. Like it, it was, it was a huge challenge. It was a huge challenge. All right, let's take this guy. Number two orders road reverse. And we'll just let him go at five. Oh no, we need to switch here. That switch there. Now he should go down there to the southbound cut. He'll stop a little bit short. Let's go to um, let's go to the number one. All right, yeah, we gotta run this guy around. Let's go ahead and passengers. All right, yeah, we can't do Silva because he's not going to Silva. Copy to the wrist. Grab you, select orders, manual, uncouple, forward. There, right, there we go. Yeah, we'll run him around and send him back on his way. And then, yeah, this is the Silva. That's where the coal car went. See, I, I that's one thing about the game. I really wish they would work on like just looking at this you have no freaking cool uh, clue cool clue what goes there right like n nothing to give you any kind of idea that coal hoppers goes there like at a minimum like some coal on the ground around it or some coal piles or something you know I really wish they would uh, they would flesh out the industry so you had a better idea of what's of what went there so when you go by you'd be like oh well, that's coal goes in there or lumber goes in there or whatever like you really don't have many visual indicators as far as like what goes where um but that would help a lot you know a pulp wood loadout would like have wood laying around everywhere pieces of pulp wood stuff like that stacks of it you don't really you don't really get that I get you forward. How's he doing? Yeah, he's he's pretty good. I think he'll make it to Whittier. Then we can get him taken care of at Whittier. Now get up here and grab these guys. This game is so addictive though, especially when you're working towards something. It's a challenge. You're like, can I can I make all this happen? All right, let's get him back the other way. Shift click. Let's see, where is it at? There you are. All right, everything's good. Nice, reverse, warp speed. Let's go do your thing. Go do your thing. We can't. Yeah, we can't really do anything in Dillsboro yet. All right, this guy's holding short. Now let's grab him. Select orders, manual, reverse. We'll couple up and pull down, and then we'll be ready. So first move we'll make is to set this uh, coal hopper. That's our company, coal hopper. It's funny. I just said the other day, I was like, we need a coal hopper for Dillsboro, right? We need some more. 
honestly, I would love to have... We've got two up at Bryson, two at uh, Whittier, and one down here is five. I would like to have at least 10 cars, 10 or 20 cars, honestly, sitting around a coal. If we could bank 20 cars of coal, then we would have nothing to worry about. That's good. This guy got... Yeah, he... No, he's he doesn't have... All right, yeah, none of them have handbrakes, but we do need to lace the air. Sweet. We're good. All right, let's take them, uh, take them south. I was kind of hoping we could scoot over in front of him to, um, set that coal hopper over at the tipple but I don't like yeah that's not going to happen it's starting to feel more like a railroad now we got blocking we got set outs we got pickups we've got all kind of stuff going on passenger train should be oh he's got to stop at Dillsboro though so honestly we could make that move we could go ahead and make that move because he's going to be sitting down there for seven minutes. We could totally make that move. We're going to do it. All right, slow this guy up a little bit. I hear him. I hear him down there. That's cool. You can hear him so far away. I hear the number one. Put that switch. The switch. That one. And then we need to get this one too. Let's go ahead and reverse this guy. Start sending him back this way. I'm hoping we can just run around the number one at Dillsboro and then go on about our business. Yeah, he's going to go right there. I wonder, can we kick him through all those switches? I wonder. Can we make that happen? Hey, <laughs> can we make that happen? Save ourselves a little uh, a little trouble here, right? Yeah, it looks like it's totally going to happen, right? Evidently, s switches don't really affect how cars roll through can we get them on a good spot though without like running them into the bumper it's kind of it's kind of a tight spot just a little bit just a little bit come on nice 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 we totally we did that like a boss all right back the other way all right take him ahead Oh, he's on the main. I didn't line him in at Dillsboro. He's still going to do his thing there, but that really kind of goofs us up as far as... No, he's right on top of the switch. Well, we'll run around him. We'll just... We'll run around him. Fine. That is not what I was wanting. I was wanting him to go into siding at the depot there. That sucks. <laughs> that sucks. Uh, always something, right? There, right, let's get the number two down there. Uh, that sucks. We gotta take that one car all the way down to Silva. Let's get that switch back. He's going in the siding. Uh, yeah, we can do the pin company cars, maybe. All 
You gotta be easy going by the passenger train because they're gonna be crossing over in front of us. Let them know. We don't see a visual of people, we'll treat it like that. He's got the crossing block, so we don't really have to. Nice. All right, we'll come out. And uh, we'll just back in behind him, I guess. This guy lined back. Make sure all our switches are good. He's easing along. He should be fine. He's not AI, but... We should be good with that and get the switch up here and he should go on about his merry way to Wilmot. And we can do our thing down here. All right, let's go. I don't know if we set those pin cars over or not. Yeah. Uh, Two, we got to clear two up and then, yeah, we could do that. Man, I hate it. He's sitting right there. We could have done all this and been done with it. I'll go on it, Spur. We could have been done with this. Could have had an early quit. This dude is totally jacking us up. We could go on and take him and send him on his way if we wanted to, really. Like, and that may be what we do. You don't have to sit there. You know what? Let's just go ahead and stop this guy. They all loaded up. Is everyone good? Three waiting. Where are they going? Three to Silva. Okay, yeah, he's good to go. Let's take this guy. Select. Orders. Manual. Uh, reverse. And then, once he gets rolling a little bit, we'll make him road. Nice. All right, yeah, it's fine. I'd rather it worked out the other way so we didn't have to mess with him any, but. All right, let's take this guy, select you. Reverse. Nice. Alright, so we'll go ahead and spot this one up first. So what we're going to do, we're going to kick that silver car down the main. We'll kick one over. And then we'll go back and grab the silver car. And then we'll come down here and kick those two in here. And then go to silver. And then we'll come back light. That that That's a pretty good day on the local, honestly, to me. Like, this isn't bad at all. A little faster than what I want. Let's slow him up some. Gotta be able to give him a little bump. There we go. Give me a kick. Good right there. That'll do. Sweet. 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 Alright, this guy is going right there, right? Yeah, he is. Alright, give me another kick. Grab you. Grab this guy before he goes all the way back to the yard. Stop you right here. Nice. Nice. Alright. Throw you back. Now let's ease down here and grab our coal hopper. A little more. There we go. All right, let's babysit this guy. Yeah, see, there's like nothing here. Nothing here to signify like what this is. Just like quick visual inspection, right? I know. I, I'm almost positive. They're going to be working on that, but um, 
it would be nice i'm looking forward to that like there's just there's no kind of visual indicators you know as far as what goes where another thing i would love to see is uh lumber flats flat cars with lumber loads on them like the sp used to do back in the day you guys some of you guys probably know what i'm talking about how they used to have the stack lumber on them you used to see that a lot before they started going to the um bulkhead flats and center beams and stuff like that i think that'd be way cool all right we'll get this guy a little further pick those two over Actually, we got to cut our, uh, never mind. We got to cut our silver car off right here. Stop, 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 stop. Close. It's close, but we're good. Okay, now we can go. The cool thing is when we do have a uh, another multiplayer, there's going to be a lot more stuff to do. Even though there was five of us tonight, we did it. <clears throat> And we had plenty to do. Like, everyone was busy. I don't think there was anyone that didn't have anything to do. Like, we uh, we doubled up on trains and that sort of thing. So, we had plenty to do. Oh, come on. Get this guy in there right there. There we go. That's good. Send them on their way. Switch back. Then we'll ease her back to a coupling. Nice. Land at West Point. So yeah, I uh I worked a local. One of the locals that I covered was on the AWP. It was a joint local. Like part of us was uh, from the AWP and part of us was from the coastline. I was the uh, I was a switchman. The uh, conductor was A and W P, and I want to say the uh, engineer was A and W P too. I think I think it went back and forth. So they would do that for so long, and then it would be the uh, switchman would be A and W P, and the conductor and engineer would be coastline. I th I think that's how that went down. All right, so we got to take this guy to Silva. Let's actually, let's do road forward. I will catch him down here. It's a little ways. Little bit of a run. Oh, we got to jerk him in there to a spot too. Yep. All right, well, that's fine. We can totally do that. We can jerk him to a spot in there. Uh, what is 510 doing? We haven't looked at him in a while. Oh, he's already up there. Man, 510, I hear you. Johnny on the spot. 510 is already. Wow. Sweet. Okay. That's nice. All right, let's select this bad boy because we're probably going to need to... Yeah, we'll go ahead and top them off while we're here. We'll go ahead and service them. Orders manual. That switch. Nice. 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 No, stop. Stop, 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 stop. Now go. Quick handbrake. There we go. Release. Now we're set. That switch. Uh, he's lined in. Yeah, he's lined in all the way. Good to go. Oh, what's our coal supply look like here? 28 tons. A little bit low. We still like the, the tipple is topped off. So 150 tons in that thing. It's just nice to have these spares sitting around. Plenty of fuel, right? In case you get in a pickle with money or something like that. This is what I look at. If you run out of money, you can't go bankrupt, at least as far as I understand. You can't go bankrupt in game. But if you run out of money, you don't have money to buy coal. 
and that's where that's where things end for you like how are you going to how are you going to get more coal to keep uh supplying your power and keep it running so um yeah that's that's the thing but if you have like several cars of coal sitting around well then it's a non-issue you could be out of money but you have enough coal to keep the railroad running so it gives you a chance to kind of turn things around if at all possible at least that's my thought on it oh crap too too far spur way too far can we do it with a little bit of independent yeah wow way less picky than what it used to be right <laughs> it's way less picky i i kind of get it though i get it it can be a pain all right we'll top this guy off and uh we should be able to pick back up at silva we won't even bother with this guy yet up here we need to take the uh so six so and start switching all right that's good let's get you let's get you back up or just a scooch right about there oh come on you had independent on him are you kidding me like all or nothing a little more all right there perfect all right number two i think he's down at silver right where's number two at number one is it wilmot number two is silver okay yeah i don't know it's hard for me to get away from the map i just like the map oh he went into siding that sucks. Okay, well. Go ahead and take him. We'll fix this. Manual. Forward. Release you. We'll just pull him out of the siding. Alright, number one's in Wilmot. Alright, that's good. So make us a little more money there. Slow you up. Nice. All right, let's back up. Twenty-six dollars. Yeah, that's not great. I'd love to see a hundred or two hundred a pop. That would be amazing. Usually, don't work out that way though. All right, so we're gonna need a little room to make this happen. That should be good right here. All right, let's take him ahead. That should be good. Get our switch. Hurry, 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 hurry. <laughs> that was a little close. Oh, our engine, like, we're in a pickle here. Because our engine is just going on. Actually, I don't know why I tried to select them. All right, there we go. Just a little further right there. It'll do. Sweet. All right, so we're good, right? That would take our engine. Orders, road, reverse, max speed. Nice, we're good to go, guys. All right, so we can take him all the way back to Dillsboro. Dillsboro Yard. Let's fly along here. Look at the scenery. Man, I would love it if they did Saluda. Saluda would be awesome. I would be all about that. All right, so this is all good. Good. That one literally just unloaded. He literally just unloaded as soon as we... That figures. That totally figures. We need to pick him up then. Like, we literally just spotted that car and it unloaded. I bet it unloaded as soon as we turned our back. 
man. All right, what else we got? Uh, yeah, we're good everywhere else other than the passenger train. We just need to uh, get the number two to Dillsboro, pull this guy. We'll just shove them down there to the yard. We'll kick them in there on top or shove them in on top of those other cars, run around to the other end, get our northbound local, and uh, we should be good to go. I think. I can't believe that. Like, I'm almost... Almost kind of want to leave that thing there for a bit and just not worry about it, but since we're already down here, they're like, oh yeah, by the way, we got an empty for you. Like, no, why couldn't you tell us that when we, <laughs> when we spotted the other car? Why? Why are you being that way? All right, here we go. Here's number two. Grab him, get our fusee up. We'll go grab that car. I just really just kind of aggravates the crap out of me that we spot that up. And as soon as we spot it up, as soon as we get down the river, they're like, oh yeah, we got another one. We got one ready to go. Fix that handbrake and fix that one. Evidently, Dillsboro Freight House, they don't like us. <laughs> they have, we must have done them wrong somewhere. Somehow. Well, get on up there. There you go, a little further. Alright, forward. We'll kick one over, kick back in, and then we'll be set. Then we shove them into the yard. All right, anywhere in here. Yeah, we'll go ahead and stop now. All right, let's get a kick. That'll do. Send him on his way. I'm just going to let him keep going, too. Like, we'll catch up with him in a minute, and we'll shove him in into the yard up there, but... He's not going anywhere too terribly fast. That'll do. All right, get her switched back. Start using this guy down there. We'll let him grab the, uh, let him grab the flat. too fast sound like he was going away from me I thought he was in forward for a second I was like wait a minute him a little further down in case we have to spot anything on top of him some point That'll do right there. I think we could hit that guy at two. If he's moving a mile an hour, I mean, hit him at six. Nice. Right, let's keep going with it. Keep on serving. That switch. Oof. Well, yeah, we were bad on that one. That's a bad infraction, Spur. Didn't lie on both sides of the crossover. <laughs> no. 
Fortunately, we can't kick him in on his end. Why is the doors open? Close those up. It's that handbrake. So we got to shove him in a little bit. Yeah, just shove them down in there a little bit, and then we'll go to the other end, grab those cars, and head north. That'll be easy switch too. Won't be much to it. I think it's traveling more distance than um, anything. Yeah, Dills Pro Yard Job isn't too bad to work. Honestly, granted these are tier one as well too. Probably get busier, but the thing that sucks is you have to split this job with the silver paper mill. So. Slow this guy up a good bit. Come on, slow up. There we go. Probably bump these down in there a little bit, so in case we have to set anything else down here. There we go. That'll do. Take a switch. Right about in here. That'll do for them. Oh, come on. Right on top of the switch. And we should be able to go right down this track right here. All right, nice. We've gotten a lot of work done down here. We had a good, that was a good cut of uh, cars. Good bit of work that we had to do. Yeah, all we got is the three. That won't be nothing. That won't be nothing. All right, get all these switches here. It'll be a bad day. It will be the first time working the uh, Dillsboro local. We're still working towards the uh, Mikado. We're almost there. We've almost got twelve hundred or twelve thousand dollars. Twelve thousand and forty seven hundred would be sixteen seven. I said I wanted a minimum of seventeen. I'd really like eighteen because I want to pay a thousand towards that loan. We're just going to be broke as hell after that. Like we shouldn't need to order any coal anytime soon. We've got spares sitting around. Tipples are full. So we should be good with that. Let's switch back. Yeah, I, I think we we should be able to get get by on 2K. I think we can get by on 2K. We fixed to have a lot of money. If we could cycle one day, if we could cycle ahead one day. We would get a ton of money off that pulp wood in those log flats. Yeah, we would be set. That handbrake there. Let's go ahead and lace these air hoses. Get you. Get you got air all the way through. Nice. All right, let's go. Go north. Get this guy. Let's make him road warp speed. Let's uh, let's fly ahead. Yeah, we don't need that switch there. Glad we did that. Get this guy lined. There's a the tunnel. Let's fly over it. There we go. Yeah, you can't go through it. You have to go over it. Even when you're following the train, it goes over it. Like, because the ground has a collision pretty through here, though. It's really nice. Who is this right here? That's the Pulpwood place. Okay, yeah, that's Pulpwood right there. This is uh, Barker Siding. I think our first place is going to be Wilmot. I'm trying to remember where the Schist place is at. Man, this is a long, this is a pretty decent run for the local, honestly. Like, 
I, uh... I don't know about this. Honestly, we... We, I think Schist is right here. We may have to change this local up a little bit. Honestly, he's a little... Like, I think it's closer to... Um, a little bit closer to Whittier than... Hillsboro. Yeah, he's going to have to go through two sidings to get to Wilmot to do that. And out of Whittier, it would be one siding. Thomas Valley, why is he stopped here? Really? Got to switch against him? Yes. Come on. Um. Yeah, I just, I don't know. The, it's, it all goes back to not having enough power. Like, we're already um, running to Ayla. Well, I mean, the, the 511 is going to be working Ayla cars now, so technically that's not an issue. So the Whittier local could just run south. All right, we need to figure out where does the... Um, where does Slay, Micah, and Schist... Where is that at? Here. So they both go here. They both go to Wilmot. Okay. Yeah, they both go here because this is this is a house track right here. Uh, Wilmot Station house track. Yeah, okay, so they both go right here. Yeah, honestly, this would be an easier job for the Whittier local, I think. So we may send these cars to Whittier instead next time. He can just come south real quick. It is a trailing point move. Like, it's perfect. All you guys do is just kick them up in there and then head back north. It's a lot closer. Like, this is a long run for the... Um, For the number two, yeah, this is this is a long run for him. I'm I'm not a I'm not a fan. I'm not a fan at all. All right, we're finally rolling up to Wilmot. Thirty one dollars, not bad. Uh, we're finally rolling up here. What is our passenger train doing? He's just now leaving Whittier. He's got to go to Ayla. Uh, you know what? We better get him situated before we forget. We're going to get sidetracked and then. He's going to go on about his business. We're going to forget about him, and then we're going to be in a pickle. We'll get him lined real fast. I'm going to, like, for the end of the line, I'm going to put a fusey out. I, I don't, like, I don't know what's going to happen once he finishes loading and unloading. If he just sits there until you turn him, or, like, how that works. I don't know what he's going to do, but... I don't want to leave that to chance. All right, let's go back to number two. Um, yeah, we got to jerk these guys in. We got to jerk them in. Let's do reverse full independent. Let's get that. What is the grade right here? It's flat. Is it flat? Is it okay? Cause it looks like it's going uphill for some reason, but it, I, I guess it's flat. All right. Independent off. Let's go. There we go, that's good. Going about, going about your business there, dude. Go. Nice, get the switch. Oh, no, no, no. Let's uh, apply. Yeah, that didn't, that didn't help. <laughs> it worked out, but come back. Come back. Come back. It's too much stuff going on. I can't handle all of it. It's too much. There we go. All right. Go back to this guy. Go from Mo Gulf Mobile Mobile in Ohio. GMO. Stop him there. Nice. Then we gotta jerk these guys in. And then we're done with our Dillsboro local. Like that easy. We're done with it. That's crazy. Not a bad local. I will work these cars out of Whittier from now on though. That is for sure. These cars are gonna come out of Whittier. 
Please. All right, let's shove them ahead. Give ourselves a little bit of room here. Yeah, the the Wilmot cars are going to go to Whittier. I think it's a lot easier for them to work this than for the um, for the Dillsboro local. That is a fact. Go ahead and get everything lined up just in case. There we go. All right, he's in reverse. All right, let's go. Pull on a little bit there. Nice. These are the moves that you have to be extra freaking careful about because if they stall on that switch, if they stall right here on top of the switch, we're screwed. Like you're absolutely screwed. And there's nothing down here to pull them back out. There's literally nothing down there to pull those cars out and you can't pull them by like you're straight up screwed i don't even know how you would fix that other than to take your engine and ram them and derail them and get around them and then like fix it i, I don't know if you guys have a suggestion or an idea on how you could fix that if you ever ran into that like it would be rare because usually you would for the most part, I have power south, somewhere south of it that could come up and get it and fix it. But if you don't, you're screwed big time. Like, you really just are. If those cars installed on that switch right there, um, we would have been in trouble. We would have. And I should have, I should have jerked them a little harder than that just in case. All right. I think we're good, guys. I think that is it. Right? That's it. We're good. We've got everything that I want to get done today. So, uh, that's going to do it for this one, guys. Hope y'all enjoyed. That's the Dillsboro Local. The first time we ever worked it. I see I want to make some changes to it. Like I said, we're, we're going to make a few tweaks to it. But uh, all in all, not a bad trip. Anyway, thanks for watching, everyone. Love all of you. Be sure to hit that like and uh, subscribe. And we'll catch you on the rails next time. Peace. No, big cat. No. <laughs> oh, no. No, no, no. Kick. Oh, that's, uh, that's a mix. It's the weirdest day ever. Oh no, he just fell. He just fell.